This past weekend, we had our fourth farmer's market, and it was an, a huge success. We had so many community members from all walks of life come to buy uh, fresh produce from our BIPOC vendors. I think we had a total sales of close to $5,000 this month, which is exciting. That's exciting. Uh, $5,000 this Oh my God. Yes. And any surplus produce that was not sold, ACHD sold, and you know that we distribute that to our elders and our families in need. So it, all, it was a huge success all around. And um, I just wanted to share with you, we also had amazing prominent leaders come to visit us. For example, we had, this was a total surprise, had no idea that Congresswoman Pramila Jaipal was coming. So Pramila Jaipal came? Yes. In <laughs> yeah. That's great. That's beautiful. It was so great. And she got to see the farmer's market. She also got to walk around and even check out the ERAP team and how they're working on rental assistance. Talk about wraparound services. We just... We oh, killed Pramila it this is walking the walk. Absolutely. That's what we also I like. had King County um, Council Member Joe McDermott come, and he also got to tour and see um, how the ERAP team was working as well, seeing them in action. And I heard that he bought flowers and also some produce. That's yes, he also did. amazing. He did. Thanks to um, our leaders. We also had Sarah Levin from United Way come shop this weekend. And Sarah Levin from United Way. Yes, and we also had leaders. our good friend Kim Kim Wright from Salty Foundation come. She did purchase a few popsicles that I really love from the Ma Pops vendors. Um, shout out to the to our amazing vendors who just provide the most amazing high quality food that um, that our community members have been yearning for and asking for for so long. I'm so glad to hear all that news. Our farmers market's booming. Yes, yes, and I can't wait for next month. And hopefully, you'll be able to join us. And actually, that's what my what I wanted to ask you is. You weren't here last. The only person we were missing was you. And so did you have anything to share with the community? Yes, yes, Pilan. I absolutely want to share that this is, you know, our, our community connecting with Mother Earth. Yes. You know how we are most of the time busy and not even worried about the environment, the food we eat. Yes. And also uh, it's an economic development absolutely. project for our, our community. So. Ah, I can't I can't wait to see more of this because I also learned that the neighborhood was so excited. People were coming from all over the place. Absolutely. Children with strollers and elders and everybody. Yes, thanks to I love the rich <laughs> no, neighborhood. It, it's nice. It's and so welcoming, absolutely. And thanks in large part due to um, the enormous amount of media attention we received over the summer. Yes, I, I, I also agree with you. A lot it, of, a a lot lot, of friends, a lot of media attention. A lot of our friends um, have posted on their social media accounts, on their newsletters. Um, we also had prominent uh, media outlets and talk I think about our Rachel, work. Rachel has done an amazing job. Thank yes. you, Rachel. I think that was a fabulous uh, job what she did. Yes, our our fund developer and our food access director, she Rachel Perlot, she's amazing and has was one of the has been a pillar in making sure that this this program is a successful one. So I'm really grateful for all of her hard work and also just make partnering with the right volunteers and and connecting with all of the BIPOC vendors and the, the variety of food that is available at the farmers market. All uh, of that is. Rachel's I also work. want to take the opportunity of thanking to our 
uh, funders. Uh, a lot of community members came to not just shop at the farmer's market, but also to work um, with our case managers and around getting their rental, um, getting rental assistance. Mm -hmm. and, and also we had our eviction prevention team there, so we were working on providing uh, utility support too. So lots of, lots of wraparound services so happening. Kudos to Brie Nakalala as well. She's really shining. Yes, yeah, and the ERAP team. The ERAP yes. team is, did a great job and even shared their information with the people that were there that to see our, our work. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, super. So our next farmer's market is October 9th, which we hope that you will be able to join us. Mm -hmm. It's from 11 to 3 p.m. Mm -hmm. at 9421 18th Avenue Southwest in the Del South Delridge Enclave. So we hope to see you there. Thank you. Thank Cheers. you. Hello, my name is Bree Nicolello and I am the Community Development and Rent Assistance Manager for African Community Housing and Development. Today we are here at African Community Housing and Development's Farmer's Market and not only are we helping folks get access to fresh and yummy foods provided by farmers here in our community, we are also helping folks out with rent assistance. So if you're somebody who's been struggling through this pandemic like so many of us, African Community Housing and Development is providing rent assistance to folks throughout King County. We were gonna pay, we're gonna pay up to nine months of back rent and three months of future rent. Your landlord forgives the rest. Through this program, um, we also work with your landlord to make sure that you are safe and secure in your home. You don't have to worry about eviction. So right now, folks doing this program, their rent is paid until 2022. So please come to our office. We do walk-ins every single day. You can also give us a call at 206-257-1166 and make an appointment. Or you can come to our next farmer's market here on October 9th. We would absolutely love to see you. Thank you so much and we really, really hope to see you here. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Daman datka kaso qayb galay family market ka manta okuya la white center ka del reach or African community a host grain so. Dadka ka soo qayb galay oo dhan waan u mahadnaqaya dhamaantood iyo wariyaasha iyo dadka kala duwan oo communityada kala duwan oo isku imaaday meesha iyo shacabka balaaran aad baan ugu mahadnaqaya waxa kale oo jira ayadana inuu maanta jiro qolyaha talaalka ayagana oo wasaaradda caafimaadka ayagana joogo waa u mahadnaqaya oo talaalka maarta sameeynaya maanta waxaan kale oo u mahadnaqaya dadka farmariska oo kala duwan oo meelo kala duwan ka imaaday ayagana waan u mahadnaqaya waa maalin weyn oo farxad leh Washington, Development, een shaqooyinkii kale ay ku qaban jirtay caadiga ah ay ka mid ah ay ka mid ah ayeen maxaan ku raahday een een caawinta crowinka iyo talaalkii covid-19 intooda ma meesha ku soo geeyeen 